still so young and I, I try to like really watch everyone and take everything that everyone does good and, and put it into my own surfing. John and I were surfing in Portugal and I was watching him and I was really, really close to this air that he did, this alley-oop, and he was so low off the bottom, like really, really compressed. I was like, oh my gosh, that's the secret, you know, hold all your speed in and then really pop off the lip. In the past, I've had a hard time doing really big airs because I'll like go super high and then I'll extend, but you gotta keep your board close to you for sure the whole time. Nowadays, a lot of the top guys look at the frontside alley oop as almost a modern day floater. It's a similar section where you want to get distance across the wave and into another maneuver. You want to draw kind of a, a parallel line up the face. You'll notice it's a shallow bottom turn, kind of mid face. He gets really low and coiled up here so he can get extra pop and twist. As he exits the lip here, pushes extra hard on that tail pad right as he leaves the water. He really sucks his knees into his chest. What you want to do is rotate around and spot that landing and stay centered over your board. And as he spots his landing and starts to come down, he'll slowly start to straighten his legs to stay planted on his board. That stance nice and wide and you want to stay low and centered over your board so you have that control to ride out of it. <laughs> 